MTN TV News visited the Kahiso Cemetery situated in the west of Johannesburg following complaints by residents about the state of the graves at the cemetery. On entering the cemetery, it appears to be a dignified area in which the dead are buried peacefully. But as you drive further in, it's a different story. We spoke to angry families at the cemetery, and this is what they had to say. We feel bad. We feel bad because I don't know who who got company about to borrow na lero na one talukan. Kore a a a kiting kaho bela yon ay I don't know who got the karamo to borrow na. I don't know who got the the melon blue to borrow that one melon so. Mas bela borrow na habi hardly ni mabitla. Yabo bedi. More me with them, maybe la. Ah, well, who do la hot for me? There or to a halibita. Why sink? Did not the awaila whom you go to come at last come. So I read to her about Baron Navarbeti, Saint Lena, because of Maspala, say any action. I can't find the grave I'm looking for. These were words uttered by a man who had been searching for at least an hour for a grave of a loved one at the Kakiso Cemetery. I'm here looking for my uncle's grave. So now the problem is other graves uh, are dropping down because of the soil is too soft. And the other thing that's making it difficult is because of the people who are taking care of this place, they burn grass. So other names are in plastics. So, so those plastic names they burn. So when you're looking for someone, it's difficult to find the grave. I don't want to go fishing. Hundreds of graves have been submerged or fallen through the ground while some are on the verge of collapse in one section of the cemetery. Some have complained about the neglect of the cemetery by the municipality, saying the municipality did not care about it. I came in to pay for my tap, but I repaid the lady to repaid the lamb because my bitter one, Alice. And I have to more really move them more well, but have you any action ever yet? Ah, it is it's very 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 difficult. Eh? I wish maybe they could get proper maintenance people or people who clean properly, because of the way they are doing it, they're taking shortcuts and their shortcuts are bringing us problems. Can I let me see my name? Mopati le mosi section, ka 2022 ka July. Yes, this site mobu a thing too soft or a well. Nerka kopa our own municipality to do something, kamobu or to change the section, kubeya basuibarona to the other side. We are concerned as a resident takahiso, kabakala mu, because in five months, four to five months time, kisne kipata mushiman ibita kehaluwezi. According to those who have their loved ones buried at the cemetery, this was because the graveyard was built on a wetland or soft soil making it difficult for those who are visiting their loved one to spot the graves they are looking for. Actually, the third time I come here, I'm still looking for the same person. So it's difficult because of the grass is burnt and his name was on plastic. Yeah, so since, since they, they burnt the grass, they're trying to clean up. It's extremely difficult. It's very difficult to work with because it's so well that they have to go to office in Zambia. So they come here for symmetry. Then over there they work with Bulu Kileling. But when they get there, they work with Bulu Kileling. Modi begins to Then when they take care of their work, they work with Bulu Kileling. Because the number of Zambia has just fallen down because of a kid who works for a cutter or a job that has fallen down. Difficult to go to a lona. As now, Ribatako, 
Contro le tratto papà, le tappa già che chi è di te fa lo abbano. Mm. So, o è tra copie che ne ha MDN News visited the Mukhale City Municipality to get comment on the issues raised by those who have their loved ones buried at the Kakhizu Cemetery. We were met by Ngosna Tizali, the mayoral spokesperson who said they would rather respond to the issues raised by the channel after speaking to the department which was in charge of the graves. He however failed to respond to the questions and did not answer his phone or messages sent to him.